mentioned with the baddest men on the planet for a long time, though. The title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. So here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas, knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world? Tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. Now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world. It's Rudy first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Mumbai, India, presenting the challenger, Big. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending USA heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? All right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true 5 2 opponent. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. He can keep his opponent off of him. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. It was a good night if that landed. Body kick now by Lee. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes him stop throwing it. Big punch lands to the middle. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being 
busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Right hand upstairs. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see as the opponent starts to slow down, he cannot take many of those kicks. Connects with a right. Just out of the range with that right hand. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Just over three. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Beautiful. Nice head kick. Missed with that jab attempt there. Great punch. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Real nice body kick land. with the left punch there. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Nice kick. Lee's hook shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Just misses with the straight left hand. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Switching stances here. Nice punch by Lee. Now he's got the Muay Thai plug. Oh, and he caught the kick. Look at the turtles in that kick. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Speaky head kick. Oh, big right hand, yes. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Right at the elbow. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast. Always brings his hand right back to his face. Oh, beautiful shot there with the hook. I'm not sure his opponent saw that one come. His opponent is taking straight punch. He's hooking right around the guard to land and land efficiently. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Big body kick land. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Man, look at that damage on the right side of his body. Starting to really bruise now. Punches and punches, punches and punches. Let's go. 
real sneaky head kick gets in there. Throws the right hand there. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that's lead the dance. Points over the top. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Lands a nice straight punch there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a great punch like this with? I'm excited to see what happens. Oh, that right hand is on point. Oh, big head kick lands. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Able to check the high kick. All oh, right, straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Looking to land the right just out of range. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. It's okay. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Nasty uppercut in the clinch. He's kicked that one blocks. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Good stick. Big leg kick land. Punches. Right hand landed. Beautiful counter with a punch there and certainly making good use of what is an obvious edge and reach. Huge block there. Nice punch there. Bleeding from his cheek now. Oh, sidekick lands. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice body. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Good punch land. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Well, he continues to stay busy, and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Well, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you got to like the output here down the stretch. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, blocks the shot. 20 seconds left to go in round two. Powerful leg kick lands. Straight punch lands. Final seconds here of round two. Separate. Right now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides with. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round.
All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. What a punch. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, locking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Real sneaky body kick. They continue to exchange. got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds the knockout. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Leg kick. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Lee going for the body. Missed with that kick. Oh, looked like that one counted. Nice head kick. Oh, big punch land. The right hand just misses. And he continues to work the body here. Able to land there with the straight left. Oh man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. Oh, he bears, lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one in the night. Great punch landed with so much power. Kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Big kick lands. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. of kicks there by Lee. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Just misses with that one. <laughs> Got the single collar tie. And they separate. Big head kick lands. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much force. Big hook. The cut on that cheek is only getting worse. His face is a mess. That was a thudding leg. Oh, good kicks. Beautiful kick. What a body kick. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this matchup. Blocks the shot. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned... Him. Big 
kick land. All right, there's the horn indicating the end of the round. So potentially a big factor here, ladies and gentlemen. The cut on the cheek sustained in that round. Certainly better to be below than above the eye, but the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. All right, next round is now under. Not necessarily a tough act to follow. Pretty good, not good. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. His opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on beat street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's gonna do to stay in this fight. Big kick. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. That's a big strike right there. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Head kick. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick. What a kick by this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique. And before you know it, boom, he lands it. Roman, now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high. And now... Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Right hand punch to the clinch. Real quick leg kick. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Good punch. Liver kick. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Oh, collar tie. Boy, tie plump. And they separate. Big punch land. Ooh. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Final minute. All right, single collar tie now. Nice, sneaky head kick. Beautiful leg kick throw. Goes to the body there. 
Oh, man, that cut is getting worse by the minute. Looking ghastly at this point. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, nice oval. And there comes the separation now. Ten seconds now to go in the round. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. Fifth and final round, fourth cup. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Ooh, big shot lands. He just misses there with the left. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Strong defense there to block the shot. Went for the inside leg kick. Nice right hand. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. And they separate. Right hand on point. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. Punch coming, it's blocked. Come on now. Let's move, let's recompose, stay focused. Big and kick. His hands are down. Let's I mean, he's cutting them down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Nice strike. Let's move now, let's breathe. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Got clip with the right hand. Checks the leg kick. How good is that right hand? Big head kick land. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know what it is. Run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. Oh, man, hit to land. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He might be out. Oh! Well, I can't think of a worse place in the world to be when you are tired. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, he might be out. An elbow! Back to the feet. Oh, he's hurt bad. Whoa! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot 
to end the fight, landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At three minutes, 15 seconds of round number five, declaring the winner by a new baddest man on the planet. There's the new UFC heavyweight champion. You don't get them all right, DC, but you thought this was going to be the result and we got a new champ. I mean, he has so much power and such an ability to shut the lights off that you almost saw it coming.